Hello and welcome. This is the Virgo Energy Vibration Reading for the second week of September 2016. It is the week ter number 36. Thank you for the like, shares, and support. Um, it is the energy vibration of the week of water. It is the moon. This moon is going to let you see what was behind the veil. As we look at the overall energy, that's going to be justice. And justice is here um, to bring balance to the unbalanced thing that has been happening in your life for a very long time, you Virgo. So there is help. Now the universe has sent um, the earthly justice to clear this um, situation. It is a week of the, the white. Think of the color white. And it is... It is a week of um, a lot of emotional upset, but it's okay. There is a lot of earth energy. You're vibrating in the week of the hurt, so this is good. Um, this is the zodiac element of you, you, the birthdays for you, Virgo. So um, it's just shifting of the energies is happening. As we look at Monday, you have a situation with an organization. And this organization, there are people who are... Um, who are trying to block you in this organization there are um yeah they're working against you in this organization so be aware of it it could be your work and it could be an organization that you have something to do with but they are trying to block you they don't want you to move away on Tuesday, you have a situation with the lovers i'm not sure if you guys have anything with a business partner or a lover um <clears throat> here but the energies are removing away from it because it's like the energy of uh, um it, it, you don't have to have anything in the uridis system but um here um i can see that the the negative energies it's like a cloud a black cloud was on top of you and your loved one and it's moving away which is extremely good so i'm not sure what was going on with you and a loved one in your life and there was conflicts and so but the energies are are trying to clear up because i see um the clearness is coming uh is the the fogs and the block um cloud is going away as we look at wednesday the chariot comes in and this is extremely good for you guys because um on top of it you're thinking that you're going to um you're making a decision to move away from something and this energy is good because when the, ch the this this energy of the chariot comes in it is always moving away it is always so it says you're in a situation and now it's time to move away and that is true because you have a situation with the organization there are people fighting against you they don't want you to be better and the energies are clearing up and lifting away and um on wednesday the chariot comes in to move you out of that situation and on top of that the energies of the um of you I have to make a decision about something wow this is so beautiful i just saw this um on thursday the energy of uh, inner strength come with also the energies of the number five the the the, the um energy of uh, real powerful strength so whatever is happening on thursday know that the universe is supporting you and is here um helping you to move out of that energies on friday it's like um from yeah it it is a week of just negative energies just removing it's like whatever was unjust um with you it's it's like clearing up because now uh, in the middle of the week you made a decision on thursday strength comes up two times for you guys and i really never see it until i start doing your your, your reading and then on Friday, the emperor comes and whenever the emperor comes, he comes with an energy of there was a situation that was just so killing your 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 energy vibration and making you sick. Uh, a, a situation of people fighting in this horrible conflict and it's clearing up on Saturday. You're going to see something better. Oh, my God. You guys are so powerful in this week because they the on saturday the the sun comes out two times so new energies are coming in on sunday judgment comes and it has to do if you are a woman there is something a, something a secret that is going to come out about your loved one take it as it comes deal with it in a proper manner 
but it's someone who you you have given your heart but a secret is going to come out about the person so hold on to whatever information try and deal with the situation because um, you have trustworthy people around you because your old energy vibration for this week even though all these things are happening these these um, negative things you you can see that it's clearing up you have trustworthy people around you and i want to say thank you for being here and hold on for the general reading general reading for the week number 36 okay the year is going so fast this is second week okay the first energy that i have is from the oracle and she says come to the edge and this is so true because sometime in all of us lives, we have come to the edge where situations have brought us so down and people are, are so negative and people try to block you in every situation. And sometimes you've just come to the end in, um, at, a, at, at the point in your life that you think, how can I um, go further with this sort of energy around me? And whenever you reach to that um, point in your life when you have reached that point when you have really come to the edge and you think to here and no further and this is when you really say to yourself, I am not letting this happen to me. Tut here and no further. I don't accept this energy. And you try either to move away from these people or you just ignore them. And the best thing to do is to ignore people who are vibrating with a lower energy vibration. Okay. Um, uh, coming to the edge, each and every one of us have had it in our lives when we try to get situations balance in our life when injustice has been done to us and i can tell you as a person just walk away from it whenever you feel that you have reached the point that you have come to the edge do not go over there's a thin line do not let people because of their negative energies and how they will deal with you make you um go over that line to total madness total shutdown total close down don't do it stand up and said this is how far you come and i'm may i'm putting a stoppage to it the next energy that we have is the energy form the, the, the um, number 36 energy and it is the energy from the second chakras and when the second chakras come in that second chakras is um, all about your base chakra it is the energy vibration of the base chakra and I want to say to you people is that it is time to um, start touching and healing your base chakra start touching healing your base chakra make sure you can clear the energies of all the negative things that are going on around you okay and by doing that you will cleanse and clear the energy of your body as we move on and we're looking at the energy vibration of um the, the another card and it is the river queen and i love the river queen she is um the river queen is here and you know why i love the river queen so much is that she bring you in the flow of life she comes and she says to you let go and when you let go she nurtures you and she helps you along with the movement in your life but she helps you to flow in a higher vibration level and in the beginning, the first card was come to the end. And whenever you've reached that stage, the river queen, she will come in to support you and to guide you up and higher vibration up and a higher positive level in your life and move you away from all these people who have been blocking you and all these energies and these people who have let you come to the end. Okay. As we move on, we're looking at the energies from, um, the um the 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 last card and it says commit commit and whenever commitment comes up is that the universe is saying to you you know you have gone through a situation that you have come to a point in your life that you feel as if you have been to the edge but guess what the universe and the angels is here your angels and guides are always support you and they never they know exactly what you came to this planet for and they never let you fall okay and whenever um 
um the 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 um the river queen comes she is helping you to get the flow get yourself in the flow of life find your divine life purpose and um by that doing then when you commit to that you will understand because you make a commitment to your divine life purpose and then the universe is just going to send people in your life to bless you and support you on your journeys forward i want to say to everyone out there everyone has a time in their life when they think wow I am at my last Latin <laughs> but you know you just look at it and said you know I am not going to let anyone push me over the ledge and you stand up and you connect with yourself and I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being here with this wonderful week and namaste